Hi, I'm Dr. Rachel Tate from Dallas, Texas, and I'm coming to you live from ACR 2017 in San Diego, California. So I just saw a really great poster, abstract number 1505, from Dr. Duggum and his group, and they were looking at gender biases for ankylosing spondylitis and particularly patterns of inheritance. So they looked at two different cohorts of 105 HLA B27 positive parent and offspring pairs to look not only at patterns of inheritance, but if there's a gender bias. So historically, we know that we think that mothers really do transmit this disease to patients, um, whether that be male or female offspring. But what we actually found was that the fathers had, an in, had the um, increased rate of transmission to patients. Also, interestingly, it seems to be that the sons are more affected in this particular subset than daughters. So this goes against our conventional wisdom. So it seems that not only HLA B27 positive patients who meet New York criteria for AS as well as radiographic damage and gender are also transmitted with a male bias. So I hope you learned something from this. I think that realistically we need to be looking into more inheritance patterns because this challenges our conventional wisdom. So more from ACR 2017 with RoomNow.com and I hope you're enjoying the coverage. I know I am.